The Virginia Healthcare Foundation, standing behind community programs that touch thousands of lives across the Commonwealth. Welcome to Health Cares with your host, Deborah Oswald, Executive Director of the Virginia Healthcare Foundation. Hello, I'm Deborah Oswald. With me today are Marilyn Tavener, Virginia Secretary of Health and Human Resources. And that amount varies by family size. The larger the family, the larger amount of income that a family can have and the child still be eligible. For example, a family of, with just two persons, you can have income up to $28,000 on an annual basis. What's the state doing to try to reach out to them? It's a very good question. Many times people may need this program on a temporary basis, but they don't know it's out there. So we try to work with health departments. We try to... Uh... I think we have one of those commercials with us. Let's watch it. Has the cost of health insurance at your job increased? Recently released data shows that Virginia ranks first in the nation for the amount employees must pay. Uh, studies have shown that the uninsured child is more than five times less likely to get appropriate health screenings, have unmet health needs. Health insurance makes a significant difference in getting children off to a healthy start and keeping them that way. And found myself without family coverage. And at that point, of course, I became a little concerned and worried and started seeking out information about how I can find some type of coverage to help my children. You know, the uh, person at the front desk of the emergency room asked me, does your child have health, health coverage? I said, yes, we have things. We have the 800 number that we're showing on the screen right now. If you know a family with children who are uninsured, don't delay. Tell them about Famous. Thank you for tuning in. Interested in learning more? Visit our website at vhcf.org.